Hey everybody, welcome to the fourth episode of the gear placement videos. Just like all the other episodes, we're going to look at different types of pro placed on actual routes while actually climbing them. Um, these ones are going to take place in Lover's Leap, Red Rock, of course Joshua Tree, and Valley of the Moon. Something I'm going to do a little different in this video, I'm not going to talk about every single placement just because I feel most of these are pretty straightforward and good quality rock and I don't think you need to hear me talking about them. If you do have an opinion about some of the placements though, feel free to share it down in the comments and let us know what you think. Otherwise, I hope you enjoy the video and here it goes. Yeah. Okay, so something I thought was worth saying, coming up here on this orange totem, which is the number two equivalent of the totem series, I feel like the heads are too floppy when you get into the bigger sizes, probably one and the two equivalents, or the red and the orange. They're just so floppy when you're moving them around in the crack compared to the other manufacturer's equivalents. And I just feel like the totems lose their magic, personally, after the purple size, this one we just placed right now, or the 0.5. But let me know what your thoughts are. Look at how beautiful this crack is, though. I just I wanted to take a second to appreciate it. It's so nice. Such a good climb. You're so funny, huh, babe? So I think this red nut is way too shallow. I think it would catch you if you fell at it or if you fell slightly above it, but I think it runs the risk of pulling out with a wandering route and the rope moving it around even if you extended it. And for that reason, I don't think that's a very good piece, but let me know what you think. Yeah. This one gets slotted in like a nut. Um, I feel like that inspires the most confidence. When you get to slot in a cam and all four lobes are still engaged, it makes you want to whip on it all day.
This point one is slotted very nicely, okay? I feel like I couldn't resist doing this. Come on. Cool. I have the totem, it's like bigger. Oh, that was perfect though. Technically, only need to place half the lobes for them to engage. Look at how terrible this three is. It's so undercammed and such a flaring crack. But I clip it anyways because I think it's my second piece in like 35 feet. And I'm like pumped and tired and scared. But time to extend it anyways. It's easy to place gear when they're so splitter, you know? Yeah. So this last point five is going to wrap up the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any opinions on any of the placements, please feel free to share. And if you want to watch more videos about climbing in the outdoors, please feel free to subscribe. Thanks for watching.